Okay guys, here we go with some editing of the WordPress website for acrylicartsandfab.com. So I'm going to show you how to log in real quick. We're just going to do a quick log out. And you come to this page right here, acrylicartsandfab.com forward slash WP hyphen login.php and uh, go ahead and start clicking that out or typing that out and I think once you hit WP it should auto fill so anyways you go to that we go to that page should bring up this um, drop in the acrylic admin all lowercase all one word and then the password hit login here is the site. We go over to Pages. Here's all of your navigation for editing the site. So on Pages, we click on Pages and we can see all of our pages. So we start with, let's say, About. Um, let's pretend we want to take out these three periods and just have one. So right now, if we look on the site, we can see the About page. Um, it has these three periods. So if we go back, I have two tabs open, by the way. Uh, if we go back to the site editor, um, you can see I clicked, deleted those, and I got to hit update after each change, or after I'm done with a, a group of changes before I view it. And then I go back to the website, hit refresh, and we have one period. So we can change any of this text. Um, Going back, you can make uh, text larger by using this. Um, you can make it smaller, you know, uh, just a normal Word document things. Um, if you wanted to add this as a link, we would select this type here, click the link area, and then enter a URL, hit add link. You can click open in link in new tab if you want. So it would open a new page when it comes up. Uh, right now we're not going to do that, but that's how you do a link. Um, other things to note on the appearance, this is uh, one thing you're going to want to know, is under appearance you go to menus. So under the sidebar over here, appearance, menus. And this is your menu structure for the entire site. So you can get as crazy with this as you want add new pages all that kind of stuff adding new pages is simply you go to pages add new create the new page and it'll show up in this list when you're at appearance menus and you just click that hit add to menu and it'll come in at the bottom once you have that in there then you just grab it you can move it wherever it's just a drag and drop so if I wanted to contact us to be under about drop it there hit save menu and it would show up on the site there um, but we're just gonna put it back where it goes here but you can nest things uh, so if we wanted to put gallery under portfolio um, we could do that um, patented color system if we wanted that under services we could do that request a quote request samples contact us could all be under that um, let's pretend we can move it all back but Anyways, contact us. So this just simplifies our navigation. We hit Save Menu. We can go back to About Us or the Website tab. Hit Refresh, and now our drop downs are there. Contact us. Request a quote. Request samples. So it simplified the navigation. So anyways, that helps to give you kind of an idea on that. Other things to edit are available, and we'll go over those on different um, help videos. So for now, that is, uh, that's all we'll do on this one. So thank you.